Wait, now it's recording. Action! What's going on here? Well, I'm just going to get rid of it. There's, ah. there's a forklift there we go. in the door. <laughs> I'm going to lift it up, see, because I can't take that brace out. So what I'm going to do is try to lift, like, put the forks up high and run tall chains in there. Then I'll lift it up a little bit, motor and transmission and everything, and then I'm going to take the mounts out, and I should be able to lower it down to the ground, and then I'll drag it out with the forklift. Done. Y'all thought it was going to be hard? <laughs> <laughs> Run me over. <laughs> I mean, how can this fail? <laughs> <laughs> Here's my thoughts. If it falls, it falls. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> Why is my camera staying all dark? It's not adjusting automatically. What's going on here? Wait a minute. You might want to check the aperture. <laughs> <laughs> if I could see you, that'd be funny. <laughs> Maybe I can see you now. Look at that shit. It works. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, this looks foolproof. Why is there a forklift in your Winnie Bago? <laughs> Standard procedure. <laughs> I did cut the bar, the brace out from underneath. So there's nothing in the way now. We just have to make, you know, make it, I'm gonna make it removable, put some flanges on there for that, but I gotta check the oil pan first, because it might need a little bit more. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> The Hemi's going in it one way or another. <laughs> oh. Is Winnie got a Hemi? <laughs> she would do some burnouts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. See one more? <laughs> Put the other one up there. Two. Don't lit under the engine. <laughs> and here's the other one. On the side. Those motor mounts are sweet. What are you gonna do with them? I I think we'll we'll have a <laughs> raffle and we'll <laughs> those are those are free to have whoever needs them. <laughs> They'll raise your engine. I forgot. They're, they'll raise it. You can see the line right here. Well, like, you can go to the video. Yeah, you can go back to the video and you'll see it. If anybody's trying to lower their Winnebago and they're worried about the engine hitting the ground, you have nothing to worry about with these mounts. It's a must have. It's a must have for any lowered Winnebago. Got some wish pertinent could... information right here that I don't know what is. <laughs> wish, I could, wish I could see it. It's so freaking dark in here. <laughs> that's, well, that's, that's a sweet mount, though. Come on, you can't. You gotta admit, too bad it ain't gonna work. Hand me that thing. There we go. Now we can see it. Ooh. Right. <laughs> <laughs> you want Tell you what, it's them? it's strong. It's been TIG welded. Super sweet. Raffle it off. You should sell this thing, man. <laughs> it's free. <laughs> free, you hear me? <laughs> Both of them. That's a pair. <laughs> you can't you get the pair that. for that low price of free? You, you get a pair for that low price. <laughs> <laughs> free. We'll even pay the taxes on that free. <laughs> well. I don't know if this one's loose. We're just going to take the bolt out and if the well, engine falls. The worst thing that happens is it just kind of yeah, drops. Right. So that's what you want to do anyway. Exactly, out, right? yeah. If the engine's out, the engine's out, one way or another. How does it don't hit this pretty stuff here? Exactly, yeah. We have to be careful. No. We have to kind of shift it back. I'm going to pull the water pump off, but I don't think, I think because once you lower it a smidgen, you got plenty of room to move it back. So I don't think it's going to be a problem, but if it's a problem, we'll just unbolt that water pump. How much is a smidgen? A smidgen's roughly this much. Oh. <laughs> Give or take. 
<laughs> Look on your calipers. It's right there. <laughs> it's, right, it's right under. You have one sixteenth. You have. Then it's yeah. right under that, right? You know the little. It's line right above and then it. The next actually. little line, and then you get the dial. It's right past yeah. that. <laughs> Smidgen. There's a couple other measurements that I really don't know if they're YouTube friendly, but you know. <laughs> There it is, another sweet mount. I got a little notch right here that, unless you're building A arms, that go really far up into it. But for free, what do you want? <laughs> oh, stop! There's a transmission crossover. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, shouldn't be a problem, though. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Here we go. Oh man, that is going to be perfect. Here we go. Straight down. Oh, hold up, is that going to pull this cardboard out of the way? Jeez, come on, man. All right, there we go. Oh, we're good. <laughs> down. Sun's getting in my eyes, so I can't see. <laughs> You're gonna crash. <laughs> you know, here we go. You think everything looks good here? I'm just looking for movement in the chains and stuff. Out. It's what about the top there? I mean, you're you're like rubbing on the mount that I made, but yeah. it's okay. The, it's I mean, the engine's perfectly flat. It's crazy. It's uh, going to start pulling the fork forward like that. But yeah. If we get to the ground first, that'd be great. We only got like another foot. We got to clear this oil or the water pump. But it's okay. Keep going. Like a few more inches to clear that. Oh, hold it. All right. Good deal. Ready to go. Keep Down? Going. Yep. Hope you built that mount strong enough. <laughs> <laughs> It only held the whole Winnebago. I'm sure it can hold just the engine. Keep going. It's gonna start skipping like that. That's okay. Once, I, once it gets past the water pump, we can shift it forward a little. Yeah. Keep going. Don't go. Okay, <laughs> that scared me a little. It's all right. Yeah, every right. other link is gonna do that. Yeah, well, it's just past the water pump a little. We're almost to where it can go a lot. Okay. Okay. Keep going. Keep going. It's all right. So good? Yeah. You only got like four more inches to hit the ground. Uh, we're, so, we're gonna make it. Yeah, you're gonna make it. Yep. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. It's gonna snap here real quick. Pull on that chain. Oh. Good? I think the oil pan's touching the ground, so. Okay. What do I do? Is this a. <laughs> yeah, your oil pan's on the ground. You only have like an inch and a half before the back is touching. Yeah, just to keep letting it go down. Okay. Here we go. Yep. You could drop it from there. Yeah, you can really it. literally drop it. It's fine. The, this, the forks are, or that part of the forklift's okay by the wall. Yeah, everything looks good so far. Okay. They're touching the ground at trans and at oil pan, so. It's a little more slack so we can unhook the chains. That it? Yeah! The engine is out! Woohoo! Call it out, call it down. Piece of cake! The engine's <laughs> down. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, power steering's got a hit.
Now just watch our body work here. Where are you trying to go? I'm going to put it on the engine and push it. Oh. That should be good to pull from there. If you could just pull it straight in the line that it's in. There you go, you're good. Look at that beast! Literally fives of horsepower. <laughs> yeah, all fives of it. <laughs> I don't know. If I had five horses, I'm pretty sure <laughs> that it would beat that. <laughs> I think we're gonna have room for this too. Get this change out of the way. Look at that. Look at that backwards. <laughs> we don't need to see this part. It ain't a Chrysler. That unbolts anyways. <laughs> but. That. Check that out. You read that? It does not say LS. That's, that's a Dodge right there. Dodge. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what's up, Rob? <laughs> that was witty. <laughs> That's all I got for today. <laughs> yeah, man, we got us a Hemi. We got all that room. This is happening. This is what it takes to fit horsepower in a car. I'm talking about no LS, none of that. Goofy like LS. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. Dodge power. Power. Yeah. Thinking. So close. Yeah. We got there half an inch. Look at that. That's a whole half an inch. I'm sure I can't see or hear this. <laughs> this is like this is almost three quarters of an inch. It's more like eleven sixteen, so we're gonna put a little bit more of the space there right here. Tip the engine that way a smidge. Got a hemi. <laughs>